She lost her consciousness until four years. That lady kept that lady took care of her until the husband showed up. We just met here at the church. She, she didn't even know the, the, the name. We just met here at the church. I didn't know, we didn't know each other until we met here. She just helped me as a good Samaritan. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus and give him the glory. Let me tell you something. Whenever you hear testimony, that's your time to tap in. Because the power lingers around. I feel the anointing over this people. I feel it. And if anybody now will rejoice in the Lord, your tumor, if you have it, will also disappear. Yes. She was in bad shape. She was losing feet. A, a lot of blood, almost like a jerrycan of blood. She was dying. God bless you, young man. Women run away. This young man carried that woman. And God had a son. And the women just talked instead of helping out. She was losing thick blood. Just pouring out of her. The Lord was delivering her. The Lord was delivering her. Yes. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Amen. Amazima matufu msumba nze omwami ono wa yanku bilange simu nganza gwa sindikira sento kutwala bulichimo kola scan the husband would send me money nze to do scan ying ayogera na abasa right from mengo here I spoke to the doctors paka wetu wa mutusa ekawempe chilo we kawempe kawempe tu watu kawe sawa msambu kwa chilo we arrived at 1 a.m. na yenga buli result nzebale etanga zinda ganti omchala aina cancer show that the lady has cancer na yenga bleeding yo ya amanyi nyo but she had heavy bleeding na yenze wempu ilo bujuli zivu na we yanku we yanku when he found me yesterday, he told me, Mr. David, let me tell you, I don't believe this. My wife has resulted in cancer. Somebody's being healed of cancer right now. Somebody's being healed of a cancer. Right now. Somebody's tumor is being healed. Ramo Shata Rababa. Yara Koshoto Robos. Somebody's being healed a tumor right now. I don't know what tumor you have. But wherever it is, put your hand there and jump in the Lord. Ha! Yes. Ha! Wow! Touch! My God, my God. Never again. My God. Blessings in the family. May God answer you and give you what you want. May the Lord give you whatever you want. My God, my God. Victory belongs to him. May the Lord restore whatever the devil has stolen. And you are good teacher. Jesus. Jesus. Victory belongs to him. I lost my mom last year. Mama na yali ya breeding abwatyo. She also had the same kind of breeding for a whole year. Bampi to am mwezi gwo kusatu. I was called to in March. Mama na fanga 18 November last year. Nera yali ya breeding abwatyo. Ka uli lo muli lo mubigere. She would fear sensations of fire. Uli lo muli lo mulubuto. Uli lo muli lo mumubiri gwonna. 
bought cancer medicine we also went to the witches and they ate all the money she never got her healing I treated her now. The devil left her and came to you. The day she died, I was... She had pressures more high. She was injected and then she Then she went crazy. She died. She wouldn't say anything. I got... I did after she died. I began to bleed. I thought maybe it was fear. I said, fear. Every spirit that you. That comes from your Every deceased people. Every evil spirit that has been attacking you in your family, from your relative, we burn it today. We destroy it today. We drive it out today. Get out. Get out of her. Get out of her. Listen, while, while, while we were praying, while you were praying, you saw a white dove. What are you saying, Jiwa? I said, when I was a doctor, I was supposed to do an x-ray. I was an x-ray. I was supposed to do an x-ray. So my husband was praying with me. I was sitting up quite down, passing. I was just going to hold his feet. I didn't have strength. And I was so dizzy. I did not tell him. I was not telling him. I was breathing bad. I had fire sensations that come back in the stomach. Lift up your hand. You must say, "I will not die. I will live in Jesus' name." Something is walking in your foot. You always feel something. Pain. Shaking. I dream my daily. She came on my window on Sunday. Get out, out of her. Mufeko. Get out, you woman. Mufeko. You are dead already. Mufeko. You cannot come to her. Mufeko. She's not dead as you are. Mufeko. 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 You woman, you are dead. Mufeko. Mufeko. What's her name? Mere Chikabula. Mere. Mere. Mere Chikabula. When Mary Chikabula and Kuragi again, I'm on Tana Weber. You go back to the great house. Why do you put on those things? Don't call her back again. Why do you put on Why do you put on those things? Pastor, if you look at the video, it's a small day. It's not 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 a small day. It's Gamba gwa mzimu Ogwa mama wangu Ogwa leto vlade jendi Nakula bidida Neku janjaba Nofa Ati umu la mirembi Toda yoku nonya Toda yoku ntambuli dako Toda yoku erete wangu Toda yoku Toda yoku you. Oh, bleeding, I command you to stop never again. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost. Pick up. God. 
I'm here to testify about this boy. Pastor was here on Wednesday testifying about my mother who came back came from Kitigum and my sister. They got healed from here with the high stomach pain, the knees and the chest pain of my sister, which got her at uh, the age of 12 years. So what about this boy? I came to, test about, to testify about this boy. First of all, me being a Catholic, I never believe God can cure AIDS. I brought my mom here, and this child, they were all HIV positive. I went, to test, I went to test this boy. I went to Mulago. I tested the boy. First of all, the counselor told me, why are you testing this boy? I told him, I told her that this boy received a prayer, and I'm believing in God that the boy is healed. Even the, the pastor, when we are leaving the stage, he also said that, go and test, I believe. He also said that God has healed HIV from you. Now, when I tested from Mulago, the boy was negative. Victory belongs to Jesus. Victory belongs to Him. When I told the counselor, I said this boy was prayed for from Miracle Center, Cathedral, and he said it is not possible, madam. I said this boy, the mother abandoned him after realizing that the child is HIV positive. He came, when he was discharged from the hospital, that is Lacho Hospital, he came home. The next morning, my mom woke up and found the woman has disappeared, left this baby when he was one year and two months. So this, my mom said he was not going to throw this baby, he has been keeping this baby. The baby has been on a drug. This drug is right in front here. We left it here with my mother's medicine. Where is it? It is among those drugs. My God. And I could not believe because even the counselor was saying he can't believe. I said no. I have faith. <laughs> because the faith has healed my mother. I'm going to another place to test. You people, I went to Kamusta Center. There's a big hospital there for HIV testing and syphilis. I told the same thing to that counselor. The counselor told me, let me have the test. Let me try my level best. Let me have the test. If the boy has been on a drug, it is a rare case. I said, Madam, do the test. They put the, the result is negative. I started calling all my relatives, telling them that this boy is healed of HIV positive. And the boy is here. The one in the bottles. The boy has his medicine. First, I got the second result at around midday. I called my brother who is at home. I said, please find any way of sending the medical form for this boy. The one he has been receiving drugs every month with my mother. The boy told me that all the buses have already come to Kampala. Even the taxi, there's no way he can send it today. I even called my auntie who is a nurse at Lacho Hospital. I told her this boy is healed. She could not believe, but she said she's the one who tests this boy. This boy is HIV free. Somebody get up on your feet. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This was his medicine. This was the medicine for this boy. My mother came from the village. She didn't know that they would ask for a medical form. So they always travel with their drugs as long as they've given them. Because those medical forms, they don't want them to move with them. Anytime somebody can miss that place, you'll not get a chance of getting another drug. So now, you people, I myself, this boy came in my house. I never liked the child. I told my mother, I have three children, and I'm a single mother. I don't want more problems. I am I'm tired of treating you. I'm tired of treating my sister. Now you accept this child who is HIV positive. I'm fighting for my three children, plus you people, I'm a teacher. 
I'm a nursery teacher, I earn very little money, 350. But you people, since I, I started this work, I don't have a single coin in my account because of treating my mother. Even from school, my director, they are tired of me leaving work, asking for advance because my mother is admitted like you. My mother needs ambulance with this child. Two weeks, two months ago, before they come here, this boy was at Lacho, at uh, Achut, child care, because he has already been totally down. We all thought the boy was going to die. Two months, he has been on that center where they feed children with nutrition. Even the boy came when the stomach was very big. I never liked the boy in my house. I thought he's a problem in my life. I asked God to forgive me for hating this boy, but my mother stood for this child. I think no God has a miracle for him. People of God, run to Akaton. People of God, run to Akaton. And that translator said she's, she's oh. going to come and see me testifying whether the boy was prayed from here. What she said she's come. Her name is there. She's called Sese. Please, if you are here, please come. Sisi. Counselor Sisi. Mulago. Sisi. From Mulago. Oli, Oli we Mulago. And Fiona from Mulago as well. Fiona is from Kamocha Health Kamocha. Center. Fiona is from Kamocha. Okay, this is, we start with Mulago. Ongen Emma, that's his name. That is his name. Ongen Emma. Okay. Results, you either they say positive or negative, it's negative. <laughs> This lady was not was not just enough. She went to Kamocha for another test. These are all stamped. She went to Kamocha. These are all government places. Because you, know, you can see, okay, Christian caring community. HIV not detected. On when Emma, 23rd of December 2016. Why don't you jump and dance and praise God for seven times? Victory belongs to Jesus. Victory belongs to Him. Oh, oh. Victory belongs to Jesus. Victory belongs to. You know, after I prayed for his for her sister and mother, this kid was with them. In fact, this is the kid who got fighting yeah, he was with fighting him for the grandma because she was fighting for that. He was touching the grandmother, yes. and this boy was boxing him. Yeah. I was touched by him. But little did we know, I did not know he was HIV positive. So I prayed for the mother because she said her mother and sister are HIV positive. So I prayed, and the Lord told me, go back to the doctor and check God has healed AIDS. The Lord told me, I have healed AIDS. But I didn't know it was for the boy. What a mighty God we serve. What a mighty God we serve. Don't keep that keyboard silent. Ever. What does it take you to understand? People of God, dance and praise the name of the Lord. Woo! Praise God. celebrating the way you have been celebrating here people are sleeping me I would shout for them in the night shout for them now the next day when I was supposed to bring my mom here four of them and one of one of them was a Muslim man who went to the to, to, to my landlord early morning at six that you my landlord we are tired of this woman we can't sleep landlord came at my door and she told me you teacher Kwonsi what do you think you are you are the person I own you for months rent. You have not paid me. You are the person who is making my talent not to sleep. What is wrong with you? You people, I started laughing at that woman. I used to respect her because I know I have debt. I started laughing like the way Pastor tell us, you laugh. I laughed at her. I laughed at her. Then she said, I didn't know madness can start like this. <laughs> Pastor, that same Muslim man is called the 
Dr. Sibu is my neighbor. I love them very much. I've been a good neighbor to them. Came this morning when I was shouting again because of this boy result. Then said, Teacher Kwonsi, what is it? I said, I'm very glad God has just started working. He's going to move up to you. Then he went back. Then I told him, you first go and put channel 44. He said, what is it? I said, first put. I followed him. When they put the channel 44, me, I left them. I came back rejoicing. Then later on, like about five minutes, we are preparing with my mom to come to the church with this boy. This man followed me and said, teacher Kose, I want to talk to you. I said, what is it? Come in and talk to me. Say, teacher Kose, I have my house. This house is after Kalere. I built my house there. I'm selling it and you are the first person to hear about this news. I said, now you, what is wrong with you? Landlord is demanding me money for four months. I don't have any money in my account. Then he told me, but you work in a very good school. I said, I earn 350 much as I work in that good school. And I don't have any money. I brought for him this, this receipt of the landlord demanding me for four months. I brought the receipt from the bank, statement that I have only 2,000. He said, it is not possible. But you have this thing. When you made up your mind, you can come and talk to me. But we can still talk. I also began laughing, you people. I laugh at the man, he said, you people. You first go and testify about this boy, I'll watch channel 44 tonight. And I know that I see you are Muslim, you are watching it today. God is really doing a miracle because they want to prove me testifying about this boy. And he will come here, you people. And this is his house. He told me, you remain with the copy. I said, yes, I'm going to go well, with the this. the house has come to you. Favor now is what you need to own that house. Yeah, favor, 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 favor. In Jesus' name. Be careful, he'll come and box you. On when? Why don't you clap your hands to Jesus? Somebody. Where's Eno? Get me 300,000. They get, they get, they go buy clothes for this guy. For Christmas. My God. So pick up. You're going, you're going to, uh, we are not finished with you. We have to follow Sarah. Sarah. Is Sarah around? Where is Sarah? This lady does a great work. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Thank you. You know, this is one person who puts fuel in our car. I even don't know how your husband can contain you. Our children. She follows up everybody. I want you to follow this kid. This is a powerful story. Of God mercy. The mother abandoned the boy. Now God. He abandoned the boy so that he can come here so that he can be healed oh, get him a Jew somebody the little kid he has since evening get him a biscuit get him some biscuits some juice get some juice and give this kid hey buy him some clothes on when? when? <laughs> Why don't you laugh now? Seka. <laughs> Since we started 77, do you know how many people have been healed of HIV? Get up on your feet and clap your hands to Jesus. <laughs> okay, Ongwen. Ongwen. This is for you. Pastor, this boy has a name. 
only that the doctor could not write it well. His name is Ogen Rot. Ogen Rot means in our language, naturally, that trust in God. That is the meaning of his name, which was given to him. Ogen Rot Emmanuel. So really this boy was a blessing from God. Because of that name, I didn't understand the meaning. I was just asking my mom from out, what is the meaning of Ogen Rot? Then she told me that it means trust in God. For your matter, for your matter, for your. What is this juice? You are hiding it. Boy is juice. For me, it's never juice, woman. My God. Even if we don't hear any more testimony, we just never come out. Even if we stop here, we just never come out. My my Christmas is done. <laughs> 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 that's why Jesus came. <laughs> I said that's why Jesus came. <laughs> Clap your hands to Jesus and <laughs> give him <laughs> praise. <laughs> yes. Yes, praise the Lord Church. Amen. Uh, I'm called Moses Oshen, and beside me is my wife and my two children. Uh, we have come to testify and to thank the, to thank God for healing our two children, and also to thank Pastor Robert Kayanja for setting up Channel 44 so that we can be viewing. Uh, we thank channel 44 because we didn't know about the crusade which was for 77 days first which was going on so uh, our kid here our son he was very very sick he woke up one night when the leg was the leg was swollen very big this one here it was swollen i gave the photo to mr mike mr ronnie the other side he will put on a screen so the leg had swollen very big he couldn't even play, he couldn't even do anything, he could just sit and start crying. So he started just, we could see him scratching the leg. At night he couldn't even sleep, so he could be carrying him every day, scratching for him with the leg. He could not sleep, even ourselves he couldn't sleep because he could cry too much at night. So me and my wife, to take care of him, we could sleep at night on shift. Because every morning I could go to town to look for a job. So she could sleep first. After round two, me I remained with him, carrying him and scratching his leg because he could not sleep. So around two, I could wake her up to take care of him until the morning. Then from there, one day I was going to see a pastor. He's a prophet. He's staying in the center. So I met a gentleman in a bus, Costa. He was going to Mokono. I explained to him my problem. Then he told me, Why do me? I'm from a crusade this morning. Why don't you go to do you watch channel 44? I told him, No. He told me, Go when you go back home, tune channel 44, and your problem will be solved. <laughs> so when he told me that, I promised him that I will do that when I go back home. He told me it is okay. When I went to see the pastor, when I told the pastor my problem, he told me, uh, he also told me the same thing. Do you watch, which channel do you watch? I told him I always watch uh, Emmanuel, TV, Emmanuel TV for Pastor TB Joshua for Nigeria. He told me, no, from today, stop watching that channel. Start watching channel 44 because I'm also a prophet. I'm also a prophet. I'm a pastor as well, but I respect Pastor Kayanja because he's well blessed and he can help you. So, I send you to go to Pastor Kayanja, Pastor Kayanja's church. There is a crusade for seven, seven, 77 days of glory. First two have started. Go to him, the church, and your children will get healed from there. 
So when I get back home, I found my wife was watching uh, TB Joshua of Emmanuel Television. Then I told her from today, I don't want to see you watching that channel again. Start to tune to channel 44 immediately. So when we tuned to channel 44, uh, there was a preaching going on. The service, so like last night's service, was, they were doing a repeat. We sat down and started watching it. So we saw how people are getting healed, people are giving testimony, they are getting healed even through television without going in a church. So I told her, this boy, the boy was very, very sick and had no money. She had gone to a pharmacy, a nearby pharmacy, and they told her 25,000 to get her a drug for the boy's legs. I told her, I'm just from town. Uh, I went footing and came back footing. I don't have money. So let's just wait at night when Pastor, Pastor Kanja is praying. We shall put the boy's legs on television, and I believe he will get healed from there. So we, we waited because it was going to be our first time to, to watch the, 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 the church service of seven, seven days of phase two. So we waited until it started. So midnight when pastor was preaching and praying for the sick people, I, I carried him, then I placed his leg on a screen of television. He was sleeping. Then we said, very many people are testifying that they're getting healed from TV and they, they are okay. I also want my son also to get healed from the TV because I don't have money to take him in a hospital. So when we did that the next morning, when the boy woke up from their bed, I saw him standing with one leg and he's carrying the sick one. I started seeing him putting the legs slowly, slowly but he could not move because it was, too, it was swollen too big and he couldn't, he couldn't put it down. So I told the mother, you see, this boy is starting getting healed. But she couldn't believe. I told her, you just give the boy time. He's going to get better. So reaching evening, I said to see me want to play, but couldn't manage. So the next, after two days, I said to see me moving. He started playing around. Now the, the, the legs started drying, the, losing the size. Losing the size. The legs started losing the size, and I was very happy. And I told my wife, you know, me, I was not a born again Christian, but for her she was a born again. But we could pray together in the one church, that's Victoria Church Kisogo. We could go together every day, every Sunday, as a family. But I was not born again yet. So after seeing my son, I've got here. I told her we have to go to Miracle Center for Pastor Robert Kayenja, and me I will get saved from there. <laughs> so then another another testimony is. This, 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 this one's the elder. This boy, he used to uh, uh, eat chewing, chew, chewing his tooth at night when sleeping. And it could start with him from 2 a.m. at night when sleeping. You just hear him as if he's eating a bone in his bed. Too much. It's like a year because for him, even from first time when he started studying, that thing would disturb him. And at times could wake him up and start crying. So in the middle of this year, even this boy, I started hearing him as well, also showing the tooth. Like as if they're eating a bone. So when we start hearing that, we could get scared. Then we could wake them up. Then we could do praying for them and we just carry them because we could fear to put them back on their bed. We could take them to our bed and sleep with them. So after also, I told my wife, one day I told my wife, Let's wait on Sunday. Uh, Pastor Robert is always anointing people with oil, and the people are getting healed as well. So I waited on Sunday. I saw Pastor that had brought him anointed oil on bowels there. So he was touching one by one, anointing the oil, mixing oil. So we also had anointed oil, which was given to us by that Pastor of Seta. So I said, this oil has not been helping me. I'm going to put this oil on top of the TV, and when I see pastor anointing people, I'm also going to use this oil to smear in the mouth of my kids. And I believe they also get healed since the pastor is anointing people in the church. Even my children get healed from home. That, that one also happened before I brought them here for prayers for overnight. So after putting oil on them, 
the issue of biting the, the tooth and crying at night, it is stopped. My children started sleeping very well. Even us, when we take them to sleep on their bed, they don't again wake up. They just sleep until the morning. So I just thank God for, for healing our son, our children. And also to thank Pastor Robert Kayanja to set for, us, for setting Channel 44. Yeah. Here's the feet. That's the feet. What is this mark? Up to down. It was passing from up, up to down, and it was soaring big up. So this mark is from where? This is the mark which came from down. It was following the, 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 the swollen thing from down, coming up, round, the way you're seeing. It started from this way, from behind. And nobody put it there, it just came by itself. It just came by itself. At, at first, it came from down. I thought it stepped on fire, but it wasn't fire. In the morning, I, in the next morning, I it's saw so, it It's so funny. Inside. People, you have to see this. I know you've seen it on his foot. When it was swollen. You need to, you need to get the camera. But this, this mark, that one, it just came by itself. It came by itself. The devil is a liar. Be blessed. In the name of Jesus. Young man, be okay. Yeah, I, I saw it there. That's it. Okay. Here's 200,000. Take these kids tomorrow. Buy them something. Okay? In Jesus' name. And God bless your marriage. And God bless your marriage. Thank you so much, Pastor. And meet all your needs. Okay, okay. I have to go quickly. Praise God, Judge. I am Yakamoga and I was born with asthma and I've been suffering from it up to my senior four and I've just completed my senior four. But then I wasn't believing that asthma could get healed. I thought that maybe it was a joke because you have gone to many churches and I've seen many doctors, herbal and both the artificial. I've had a lot of drugs. But then I thank God right now that I've taken two months without, ever since the seven, seven days started, I've taken two months without using this inhaler. This is what, I, I couldn't sleep without using my inhaler. Or I, I had attacks weekly during my senior three up to where I am right now. I had attacks weekly, but ever since I started watching the seven, seven days, I thought maybe it's not that serious, but when I came to this place, the, the, when, when Pastor had the meeting for the youths, he said that go back home and get your Bible, call unto the Holy Spirit, and then, and then prophesy on what is, what is making your life a living hell. I went home, I entered my room, I prophesied and I said, Atma, I'm no longer you are no long, I'm, on, I'm no longer under your control. And I just slept. On waking up, the, the, I said, the, another week. And this week was a different week. Everything was totally different. Things that I'm allergic to, like drinking ice. I couldn't be in a place where it's cold. I was covered every time. But then I started taking even cold water from the fridge. I couldn't believe it myself. I, on, on reaching here, I was like, I should join ministry, what God has done for me. Then I joined hospitality. And this today, actually, Papa told me to, to, to mobilize the machines which are, going to, which are going to make ice cream for the children. And I'm allergic to ice cream. I used to be allergic to ice cream. But I thank God that right now, I don't know how God does it, but I thank God. I thank God for the people of this church. They have been so hospitable to me. Um, if Sister Helen is around, she, has, she was the one who told me to come and give my testimony here because I, I was afraid of giving the testimony. But then I thank God right now. You will never, never suffer from that asthma again. Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. 
the Holy Spirit. Marasato Rekosata. Julius. My name is Julius. I'm from Kalere. This is my third day to come here. I was always in the club because I'm a singer. Even I have some recorded music. A friend of mine who is called Dian invited me and said, Please escort me today. It was approaching 7 p.m. I said, Where do you want me to go? She didn't answer. So, they so they planned the 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 I didn't hear what they say. We came to the gate that enters here. And and people hey, you brought me to church. <laughs> she said, That's right. So I came in here and we prayed. Then we went back. The next Friday, it's I who called and said, Let's go to church. She said, I don't have transport. She said, I don't have transport. Let's go. I said I felt good when I went to church. I feel peace. I didn't want to leave it. One time I was watching television. Pastor Nagamba, Mavari TV. Pastor said those who are here. And those who are here. Mugende Kulobat Lobat Kayanja Ministry. Mulaikinga post as the posting. Like the posts that have been there. Mugenda Kula miracles. You will see miracles. So I did it. Immediately Ning and Dio Nitan Kokulaikinga. I began to like. Friends say, man, are you born again? What's going on with you, man? What's going on with you, man? I say, I like what I'm doing. I had chest pain. When I woke up that morning, the pain was gone. I believe I believe this is a miracle that pastor has been talking about. So I, said I, must, I must give my life to Christ. And I said, Every day I go to the pastor's timeline and I and, like and, like and share the pictures there. I decided to come and share my life with you. And I said, Lord, you have given me this gift. 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 Get him, get him, get him some juice. Do you guys, do you have some chicken there? Get him some chicken. 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 Get I'm a 20. You are 20. You look like you're 14. Okay. So you want to give your life to Jesus? Yes. Think about it. I mean, you, what draws young people?
What draws it to young people? A young person like this one to come at seven. It's already four. The following day and has not eaten anything and he's in the line because he wants to testify that is not religion that is the Holy Spirit and that is a big miracle for our young people in the name of Jesus he didn't want to come but now he came now tell those people to go on Facebook right now go on Facebook Robert Kayanja Ministries. Robert Kayanja Ministries. And go to like inga buri post the jabate kayo. Kamuji share inga. Post and then share the post. Eti gamba chaka tonda chitoke buri wa. The word of God may go everywhere. My God. Wanga zimbade sigenda mu church. Bade stera kugenda mu church. I never used to go to church. You get angry with your artist kakati. Whatever you did. Bagambi mungeli yechi vubu kato. Yeah. You know. Zimbade stera kugenda mu church. Era bonga mbaga kugenda mu church inga gamba. Amani hizo stories na we. Sina. See now we dey begin our church, yeah. Kati no ya yande tana muga mbaku. We begin our kungo ba ni nae viri zinu. We begin our kungo ba. I thought they would throw me out of church because of my hair. Kati begin our church siri nyayo. No kuri nyayo ngam puri randi. Na tu kali kugeti nenga mba. Kwa ni gire nenga mba na yore de nazi da kange ndi. Nenga zestera begin our church. Nae no na jito kamu ne pranga ni nae miri mbi. But when I came into this church, I felt peace. Bobo ya kare. Bobo ya kare ya magare ya magare msinga kota ni kola ofollow winge bridge ya teka yao chini. If you want real miracles in your life, follow Robert Kennedy. Zamba den singa ku umba den singa ku postinga bintu bia ba yimbi ba ba yimbi ba na ngi wichi biona ngi bintu postinga na katika postinga. I used to post. Bia teka yao bia bino bia kwa. This is what I post now. Buri program je ba malawa ni nini? Every program they do here is what I post. My God, my God. Every program. Therefore, those of you. Aba mukumbi. Come on, go and like our, 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 our page. Robert Kayanja Ministry. Robert Kayanja Ministry. Robert Kayanja Ministry. Ministry. Facebook. And you click there. Or oh, like go sharing. WhatsApp. What's up profile here? Come on, somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. This kid has been a seven, seven, uh, seven, oh, seven, seven, day. seven, 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 day. And uh, Pastors. please, all of you, all of you, get on your, take out your phone, your phone, yeah, take out your phone, call, everybody, yes, take yes, out yeah. your phone. Yes, sir. And uh, and his is true. This is his his image. We are only here when you are going back. We shall be all okay. Dead dollar. Shall be. What we are going to do? That's a big miracle. We are okay. Dead dollar. Listen. This is what he did on his profile. Yeah, choose the profile here. You have to see this. I'm watching. This is hilarious, Pastor Devin. Omraba. Okay. We put on more. We put on more. It is. It is out. My goodness. You have won. Have we? Young people don't do this. Even pastors don't do this. But for him to do this, what is your name again? I'm called Julius. Julius. So you are an artist? Yes, I've been using Dan Wiz as an artist name. So you sing? Name. You sing? I have two songs, yes. Audio. Olumuluwa video, na ye video na sasa la kuchitu ndo ba wade ba chama njia yenda la ba desi naji malayo ba desi naji malayo have you ever sang gospel song are you in behold a gospel do you rap or rapping I don't rap I sing R and B I sing R and B can you sing for us they will play keyboard for you gospel song what no no whatever whatever you want whatever you want baby Mina kupenda sana Zijaka sigiri Baby I really love you darling Baby Mina kupenda sana Baby I really love you darling Baby Mina kupenda sana Baby I really love you darling
You know what? what you it? have a good voice. You have a good voice. And you can use that voice to touch the world. Do you know any song of, of gospel? Ah, Let me ask you, is there a real baby? Or your baby or you just sing about it? Uh, no, no, but just in the Nayimba Vimbi. I just sang. A real okay. baby, but I know where you know where Zula and the Nayimba Vimbi. Banange, my friends, brothers and sisters. You know, sometimes we get people saved who are in church or who are used to church. But you could see he's not used to this. And how many like him who are out there who need to come to the Lord thank God for channel 44 thank God for 77 days of glory thank God for the Holy Spirit that the Holy Spirit made the place the, when we handed over the key to the Holy Spirit he made everybody welcome I mean Muslims come here they feel welcome. and they get saved he has come he felt welcome you can't get saved when people don't like you when people are hostile to you and I remember I told the youth here and even everybody that they're going to come in every shape and form they are going to come but they are coming they, this is the house of God. Let God deal with them. Let, them, let the Holy Spirit deal with them. They're going to come in shape and face. But they're going to love the Lord. I mean, some of you can't even stand in that line of testimony from 7 a.m. to 4 a.m. I, I, I can't do that but this young man has been here so do you know any gospel song in seven city adventists they sing some of some of the some of the hymns are very good like 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 one like one that are oh boy i forgot there's one Mm. No, 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 no. 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 Bond, soko, soko sirike. We polo te bamo imba mba seven city. Ah. Oh boy. Oh boy. I need, I need to get this. It's a very powerful. Whenever you you hear that song, you feel like touched by the Holy Spirit. Uh, it's a hymn. It's a hymn. It's a hymn. It's a hymn. Yes, I found it in Korea. I was preaching in Korea, in Korea. And I had a choir that was right. singing across the hotel Nobody where knew. I was. And it was a seventh day Adventist. And they were singing that day. And I said, I mean, the song was heavenly. But they were just singing. Me, I, me, me, I understood the words. I, I, I knew the melody was from above. When you have the Holy Spirit, the things are just words. It's a good character. I think it'll be, be a good character. So you, so you only sing in clubs and groups. Now you're going to sing in church. You're going to sing in church. And you're going to sing on channel 44 television. Our young people need to do this. This Saturday we have 
tens of thousands of young people who are coming you know from midday hey do you have something for him to bring a what do you call it sanitizer give him a sanitizer he hasn't washed his hands so you have chicken you have juice you have to give you some sanitizer so you have to give you some sanitizer you have to give you some sanitizer Okay, as they're opening, come here. Let me talk to you. I still talk to you. So you know, you know, any, any, any song, any, any song you remember when you were a child? When you used to go to church? Yeah, first the other way. Do you remember any song? I know remember what you can learn now. Hey, my catch don't do. Okay. Yesu mukama omulo kozi ya jamu si okunonya babi ya nunula no kusasira kwe ya jakuno Okay, you remember? Do you know that song? You see, you're, you're, you're very religious, you people. Because you've been spoiled. You, you sing the, these songs, you sing, and, and you miss the richness of God. I told Isaac, I told all of you, I told you the other week, get to hymns and have a file of copies here. Each one of you, if you can't sing hymns, get off the choir. That's why you are singing shallow songs. You see? You, you have to let the, the Bible said they wrote because they were inspired by the Holy Spirit. They wrote because they were inspired. They didn't write because it sounded good. They wrote. And some of these people who, saw, who wrote like Beethoven and others they didn't know how to sing but they wrote because the Holy Spirit led them to write. So if you're going to get deep in the ministry of music, you need to get deeper than this. This. So okay. Sing that, that, that chorus again. The more you be. Yes, umukama umulo kozi Yajamu si okuno nyababi Ya nunula no kusasira kwe Yesu ya ndo kola Yesu mukama umulo kuzi Ya jamu si okuno nyababi Ya nunula no kusasira kwe Ya joku nunula Ya joku mfiri you know my god wow okay they've given you sanitization What is this? Sassi. Natalia Mukasa, Vumur Sassi. 
Kasambu Mulusan. So all of Dambula ne seventy seven do. So two kids are seventy seven do. Kasambu Mulusan. Or two kids are seven seven. Do you know his? Okay. You haven't seen this. This is a magazine. The magazine. So it's yours. Yeah. Okay. Me answer. This is his seed, seven thousand seven hundred. So come and look at the end cup. So come and look at the end cup. The juice. Yeah, 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 yes, oh, come on, oh, more, cozy, yes, Japonsi, oh, no, yeah, I mean, Yajokuzi. In melody, please. In My God, my God. Okay. Where is the mic? Cousin, I'll call it down. This kid, this kid, this kid is gonna make a good television show. How many of you like to see him on Channel 44? You see, you have a following already. Okay, take your chicken. They will take you over there. Uncle Joe, I'm leaving. No, you can take your chicken and finish. Tuali koko yo wali wali mukona. Uncle Joe, mule keno gendo wali koko yo. Go over there. Gendo wali koko yo. Vida Yesu mungaleza man. Hey, take him as. Mutuali akataboke. When he finishes, wana mala. He will come back. Aja kuda. My God. Thank you, Holy Spirit. My God, my God. We have Holy Communion to take. Holy Communion. Man, what do you say after tonight? Kill the healed of AIDS. Another one foot is healed. A young man like here stay here at 7 a.m. Up to now. In the line to testify. What do you say?
You only lift up your hands and say to the Holy Spirit, Thank you, Holy Spirit. Okay, let me have one person to testify. Then others we shall pick up tomorrow. Today. Today. Praise the Lord. I thank God for 77 days of glory. Those are my names that come from Gomba. I passed a church from that area. And we were renting a building where we have been pastoring for the last four years. A university building. When they closed the university, they told us they are going to drive us out of that building. So I came here last week. I, I told the church members I'm going to Rubaga, but I'm believing God by the time I reach I was here on Thursday. Pastor preached about 28th Deuteronomy. I left here with faith that God who does miracles and blessing is going to give us blessing in Gomba. Praise the Lord. On Monday. I received 3.2 million shillings. I first called the members of the church. I told them, wait, I'm bringing money to pay for the land. God is faithful. You're coming out of the building and getting out of the land. You're going to start building. Yes, Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Praise the Lord. The God at work in this place is going all the way to Gomba via by the Holy Spirit. Praise the Lord. We don't have channel 44 in Gomba. Believe in God for church time. I Give you land in these 77 days of glory. May God give you the money to build in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. 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 Get our information. Where the church is. See what they need. The Lord will do great things. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Let's give the Lord a hand clap for Jesus. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Those are my names. I brought this to church. 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 I had prepared to bring them for a long time. Mama didn't want me to bring them. Until I decided to bring them. 
Now loose. Amen. You got Satan. Satanic. Go back and let me again. You devils get out. Go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Fire. Jijo, 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 jijo. Fire. Vakumu gongo. Fire. Vakumu tuwe. Fire. Vakumi gere. Fire. We mando na mayembe. Fire. We mizimu jalubali. Fire. Jona. Fire. We mizimu kwa sengawe. Fire. Kenda. Go. Go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Fire, 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 fire. I break you in Jesus name be delivered from the power of the devil fire 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 Release her. Mute. Release her. Mute. Yocha, 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 yocha. Fire, fire, fire. Yocha. Fire. Yocha. Fire. Yocha. Fire. Go back, go back. Fire. Go back, go back. Fire. I got a kuduka. She wants to run. Jagara kuduka jigende. Jagara kuduka. Fire. Yocha, yocha, yocha. Fire. Wherever they got you from, all of you, where they got you from, fire is destroying you. Your home is being destroyed with fire. Where they brought you, you are being destroyed with fire. And where you have been fire, she will not serve you. She will leave Jesus. Fire is burning. Loose her head. Loose her head. Yocha yocha fire vacuum twe fire vacuum twe fire vacuum twe fire 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 Genda mulinya ya Yesu get out mutomwa nono tomuchima gwe loose 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 tomula mbwe loose Genda mulinya ya Yesu go in Jesus mighty name Go. Him in Jesus name. Be blessed of the Lord. Be blessed. Be blessed.
Jesus name. Bring up quickly. Bring up quickly. Bring up quickly. Mulete. Oh, my Zimu, you want to go? Mulete, Mulete, Mulete. Take your Samira, nobody. Take your Samira, you. Loose in Jesus name. Yes. This is the book of Acts. The Bible says, and they brought their stuff and they gave them to those who had needs. This is what they did in the book of Acts. In Jesus' name. God bless you. Where is your church? on your hands together. Father, Lord God, bless this church. Bless this ministry. Prosper them. Increase them. Who is suffering from a heart disease? Who is suffering from a heart disease? Who? Who? This one. This one. God bless them in Jesus name. I give you praise, Jesus. You don't know who is suffering from heart disease. Thank you, Jesus. Is it you? Be healed in Jesus. Father, prosper this ministry. Use this man of God. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 So you are a carpenter. You make furniture. So how much will you sell this table? Eight hundred. Eh? Eight hundred. So each will be eight hundred. No, four hundred. Four hundred. Yeah. So you yeah. make them from what wood? Uh, mahogany. Mahogany. Yeah. Man, this is beautiful furniture. May the Lord increase you. At where do you do your work? If people want to find you. What do they when they come, what do they look for? Banonya. Yes with your kubo metal works. Yes with your kubo metal works. Father prosper his business. Get his information, please. For me in Jesus' name. Amen. 
God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless this your servant. Amen. God do the same. Amen. Praise the Lord. No problem. No issue. People lift up your hand to Jesus. Father, we thank you. We glorify your name. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Ashes distribute the Holy Communion element. God is so good. Lift up your hand, everyone. Lift your hand, everyone. Isn't that amazing? How many of you, how many of you remember any of the hymn of Christmas? Any? Any? Yes. Uh -huh. Anybody remembers a hymn? Yes. Mm. Do you find that very difficult that you can't even remember where you grew up? Uh,
my soul magnify the Lord and the Spirit praises His name Mary said those words they call it the Magnificat even death even in the grave is Lord. Even in the grave is Lord. One more time. My soul. Magnify the Lord and my spirit praises his name even death could not hold him captive even in the grave Jack Hayford came with a powerful song. Jack Hayford, na janu ringo lwa. Majesty, we wash majesty unto Jesus be glory, honor and praise. Kingdom authority Flow from His throne Unto His throne His anthem Oh, Lord, 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 
with those who cannot walk give them a gift of Christmas Holy Spirit I sent my word and I heal your disease I am the Lord your the presence of God is here saints his blood has washed our sins away his blood has washed our sins away oh victory in Jesus my savior forever he sought me and bought me with his redeeming blood 
He loved me I knew him And all my love Is due him He plunged me To victory Beneath the cleansing blood Oh victory In Jesus My Savior Forever He sought me And bought me With his redeeming blood He loved me I knew him And all my love is due him He plunged me To victory Beneath the cleansing Oh victory He sought me and brought me in His redeeming love. He loved me and I knew Him, and all my love is to Him. He plunged me to victory beneath the cleansing
the anointing of the Holy Ghost we are renewing our covenant to the Lord and I exalt your home I exalt your You are a savior. You are a redeemer. You are a comforter. You are a deliverer. You are our new covenant that brought us before the Father. Therefore, today we rejoice with a shout of your name. Come on, somebody shout seven times his name. Jesus. He died for us. He set us free. His body was broken for us. That ours cannot be break. Whatever has been breaking your body. Cancer, sickness, disease. Poverty, witchcraft, and shame, and sin. Today is forgiven. The blood of Jesus and the body of Christ. Was broken and spared for us. We receive and rejoice. That Jesus has arrived this week. We remember you Jesus. You are Savior and our Lord. Everybody said today My life is new I renew my covenant With my father With my God The God of Abraham The God of Isaac A covenant of wealth A covenant of righteousness A covenant of holiness A covenant of deliverance A covenant of miracles A covenant of breakthrough A covenant defeats the devil Permanently Everybody say you devil You are under my feet Permanently Get out of my family Get out of my body Get out, get out Get out of my children Get out of my grandchildren Get out of everything that concerns me Get out of my future The blood of Jesus resists you The body of Christ fights you We defeat you today Jesus is in us Hallelujah Hallelujah Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Somebody laugh at the devil. He loses again. <laughs> now you can eat the body. Hold your cup. Look at it. Say, I love you. I worship you. I adore you. I take you in a high esteem. Because of you, I'm accepted. I'm a child of God. I can sing the Lord's song. There is power in you. Oh, there is saving grace in you. There is power that maketh rich. It washes my sins. I am free. The devil is defeated. Satan is gone out of me. No tuberculosis. No blood disease. No heart disease. Life in Jesus. I am blessed.
Jesus. I am healed. I am a person of a covenant. I have a covenant better than that of Abraham. Today, today is the best day of my life. Because whatever was wrong with me has just left because of the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name. You can take. and rejoice and receive your healing receive your deliverance come on somebody rejoice
Everybody who is sick, touch where you feel the pain. Touch where your sicknesses. Touch where your diseases. This is the moment. This is the hour. This is the second. All over this auditorium. Even those watching by television. You wonder what kind of people are these. <laughs> Every night they are here until morning. Ah, we love the Holy Ghost. Yeah, we are hungry for God. Even if you don't have money, put your hand in your pocket. You may not be crippled. You may not be blind. You may not be deaf. But if you're here, you need a miracle. Touch your wallet. Touch your pocket. In the name of Jesus. I'm going to pray for you first. Then we shall pray together. Thank God together. Then you start doing what you will not do before. By the power that raised Jesus Christ from the dead. Whether it's cancer, whether tuberculosis, God is going to give you a brand new kidney, a brand new ovaries, a brand new liver. He's a good God. He's a God who touches our brains and we think supersonically. My father, I've stood here, my father, for over 10 hours. I declare your glory to these people. I've told them how powerful you are. I've shared with them that there is another side of you that devil never knew. Now it's time to descend and prove to these people that the gospel we preach is true. That everybody will know there's still a God who heals, a savior who redeems, a deliverer who takes people out. Jesus who saves, yes, who forgives sin, yes, sir, when people repent. Father, we come before you now. By the power that rests you from the dead. Jesus of Nazareth. Yes, sir, Nazareth. Oh God of heaven, prove that the gospel we preach is true. And the gospel of your son is true. By healing the sick. Let the people know through the miracle signs of in power. That the people know that Jesus is your son. Therefore, Father, I come against the principalities. I come against every demonic activity. I come against every powers of hell. You lying spirit. You lying devil. You religious spirit. I adjure you by the authority granted to me by Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I take my authority on this platform and I declare you have null and void. Your power is over. Your time is over. Get out of people's lives. Get off their legs. Get off their muscles. Get off their kidneys. Get off their blood. Come out of their bone marrow. You are HIV. Die at the root. You cancer. Disappear. You fever. You mental illness. You strokes. You attack of the enemy. Neuro attacks. Get out. Emphysema and asthma. Get out. By the power of the Holy Spirit. You demonic activities. You devils of witchcraft. Come out of the people. Get out of their chest. You barren spirit. I command you to go. Devils, you know who I am. You are my servant of God. Therefore, I adjure you. Come out of their homes. Come out of their families. Come out of their bodies. Get out of their business. Get out of their marriage. Your spirit of impotence. Your spirit of barrenness. Evacuate. Fevers go. Blindness go. Deafness go. You deaf and dumb spirit. Pack and leave. Get out of here. In the mighty name of Jesus. I adjure you by the authority. Granted to me by Jesus Christ. In Jesus name. Father the devil has obeyed. The devil is packing. The devil is living. Witchcraft has lost its power. Over this nation. Over this society. It has lost its power. In the name of Jesus. Now descend with the million angels. With the rockets of healing. They will be bombarded on the blind. Bombarded on the deaf. Bombarded on the cripple. Heal your people father. Heal your people Jehovah. Heal your people for the glory of your son Jesus. For the glory of the gospel. In the name of Jesus. And around the world. Hey, oh God raise the dead. Heal those who are oppressed by the devil. In Jesus mighty name. Let your spirit surge through. Let your miracles happen everywhere. In the name of Jesus. Those who have no money. Give them money. Those who need cars. Give them cars. Those who need housing. Give them houses. Give them land. In the name of Jesus. I command homelessness. To leave you. I command poverty. To leave you. In the master name of Jesus. And by the power. Of the Holy Ghost. We 
descends on you. Jesus is here. Yes, His power is here. His authority is here. Receive your power. Receive His grace. He has had my prayer as of always in Jesus' name. Say these words with me with a loud voice. Oh God in heaven, I receive from you the power of resurrection that raised you from the dead. Dear Lord Jesus, I receive from you the power of healing, the miracles of God in my body, in my life, in my joints. I am no longer paralyzed, I am no longer deaf. I'm no longer sick. I can hear. With a loud voice, I can hear. No more poverty. Man is in my pocket. I am free. Jesus. Yes. Now call upon the name of Jesus 21 times. Yes. 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 By the yes. power of the Holy Ghost. Yes. yes. Behold yes. the hand of God. Yes. yes. Behold the finger yes. of God. Yes. Behold yes. the miracles of God. Yes. Behold yes. the hand yes. of Jesus. Yes. Behold the finger of Jesus. Yes. Receive your healing. Yes. Receive your miracles. Yes. Receive the power of God. Yes. The hand of God is all over yes. here. Yes. Father, thank you for healing your people. Yes. You are setting them free. Yes. Demons are living. Yes. Which Craft is broken. The heart is healed. The legs are healed. The muscles are healed. For the glory of your son. In Jesus' mighty name. Now lift up your hand with a loud voice. Say thank you, Father, for healing me, for setting me free. I am free now. No more pain. No more luck. No more sickness. No more diseases. I am healed by the power that raised Jesus from the dead. I'm no longer sick. My blood is clean. My blood is clean. My eyes can see. Thank you, Lord. Now clap your hands 21 times and thank God for healing you. Say thank you, Jesus, for healing me. Behold the finger of God. I command the blind to see in the mighty name of Jesus. I command the cripples to walk in the mighty name of Jesus. I command the sick to be healed. I command the oppressed to go free. Those who are wearing corsets to be free. This is to be fixed up. In Jesus' name. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Miracles are everywhere. Glorify your name in all the earth. Now, those of you came with crutches, those who came with sticks, lift them up and start walking. And come this way. If God has healed you, check your ears, check your legs, check your eyes. If God has healed you, come this way. Come this way. Get off your bed. Sit, lift your sticks. In Jesus' mighty name. Get up and walk. Get up and walk in Jesus' name. Miracles are happening everywhere. Saints, clap your hands to Jesus. Clap your hands to Jesus. Check yourself. Lift your sticks. Lift your crutches. The power of God is everywhere. God is healing you. God is healing you. Lift your sticks. Lift Lift your crutches. Lift your body even outside. Even in the overflow. Start doing what you could not do before. And if God has healed you, you come this way. You come this way. Lift your crutches. Those of you are bedridden, get up. Get up. What you want to do before. You have to do before. Miracles are everywhere. When you came, you a guru. Lift your stick. Lift your stick. Lift your crutches. And start walking. In Jesus' name. Oh, move. Move. People 
on, stand up on your feet, everybody. Clap your hands to Jesus. Do what you could not do before. Miracles are everywhere. Check your ears. Check your legs. Check your body. If God has healed you, come this way. Come this way. Your tumors have disappeared. Your body is healed. Miracles are everywhere. Check your legs. Check your waist. Check your body. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, clap your hands to Jesus. Glorify your name. Your name. Do what you could do. Check yourself. See what God has done for you. And come this way. Lift up your hands, saints. Jesus, we love you. We praise you. The power of God is so here. I can hardly stand. Glorify your name. In all the earth, glorify your name, Pastor David. What's happening? Glorify your name, where gets us on a bitch in Kabacha College. Check yourself and see what God has done for you. This man go through. This man has been bedridden. You ushers get that man. Get him through. People clap your hands to Jesus. Check yourself and see what the Lord has done for you. Ushers, take this man. Take him in front. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Glorify your name in all the earth. He touched me. Oh, he touched me. Marasan daraba koshetale. And Lord, Pastor David, that flood my soul. Pastor, this lady for 10 years. You come this way, Joe. 10 years she's been suffering Stay from over sugar here. diabetes. Pardon? For 10 years she has been suffering from sugar diabetes. Yes. She has been suffering from headache, a splitting headache. Yes. She felt like pepper was poured in her, own, in her left eye. The power of God has touched her. The pain has disappeared. She feels her legs are lighter. Jesus has performed a miracle for her. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Yes, I thank God who brought me here. But then, I've been watching this, this, this one God over channel 44. I came here yesterday. I wanted to come earlier. I was not able. I was not able. I was not able. I was not able. I I was Naye they scanned it in Zambia hospital. They did not 
katimpulira enyindo enterede omutoguterede amaguru gabande ganu manyonga gazitowa never to suffer again we pray for your son as well pastor david what's happening pastor this lady she has implants in her she has had implants in her leg because of a result of an accident 2009 the power of god has touched her her legs were swelling but now the pain is completely gone pastor in the mighty name of jesus somebody clap your hands to jesus she had an accident walk here sister sister my god come back again come out somebody clap your hands to jesus with a yes man man i can see the scar turn this way again lift your jeans you must have jeans she has terrible scars i mean kovu in front there mumasa kutigere turn around the other way i see scars i mean kovu ne kumukono so which proves she has and he's from there i mean kovu so how do you feel katia ulirotia i feel so fine to i have been with these cars for since 2009 but there's a problem i'm not supposed to be walking up and down but because of wave two i started coming here in wave two so i've been sometimes moving from najana kumbi to here so my legs started reacting because of the moving up and down jumping praising god and everything so today the pain was too much i could not even stand there for so long i usually praise from here i went back and sat but then you said you, you were like someone is someone's uncle is being healed Pastor, i felt like someone is removing my plates in the body because i have tomatoes here and one implant my god my god i have one implant here and tomatoes here the pain was too much Pastor. you can see this one is swollen but now i feel it's too light come on somebody clap your hands to jesus what a mighty god Pastor, I'm, the, I'm, the, I'm the lady you prayed for who had spiritual spiritual fathers spiritual husbands you gave me money for hair i actually did my hair and since then i have peace in my heart i don't dream anymore i actually have peace i'm, I'm even looking more beautiful than i used to look i know praise the lord god bless you god bless you god bless you, god bless you. My God, yes, 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 Pastor David. Pastor, this lady has been wearing this corset for a whole year. Tambla, tambla. She has Lift been wearing up. the corset for a whole year. Lift it up, lady. She fell and she injured her walk back. Here, walk here. The power of God has touched her. The pain has disappeared, Yenda Pastor. In Jesus' mighty name. Dayera, dayera. Keep walking, Mama. Keep walking. Lift up the people. Clap corset. your hands to Jesus. We what my... my God, my God. So lady, mama, you've been wearing this thing for Mwa mtuera. Na benao, na kwa banja jabile na kuru. Naona darina funile bake ni andu ni enamba. Na kwa na ramba kimilimo kimikali kumkongo kwera yerundi kwa tando ha kontina. Nenga ni trendi bubi nabi. Pastor David. Mm. Interpret. Yeah, he has already said it. Okay. Wavudewa Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. We are yes, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah, you may put it over there. You are free, lady. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Pastor, Pastor David. this is Nduga Wilbur. They just came from Mulago Hospital. They looked for, there was no diagnosis because they couldn't find the complication. So they brought him here. He could, he could, not, he could not walk properly. The power of God has touched him, Pastor. This is the first time he's able to stand and the pain has completely disappeared after one year of, of being in pain. Wow. So how do you feel, young man? Feel okay. Do you feel the pain? Yes. Uh -uh. No. The pain and is gone. Yeah. Kale tu bade banga weeks inge mone chitu nonga tu bade kuchita na mola go ne kaba no njezo burua do burua de bubuze katika ba tu gamba tu genda tu mola go mola la ba kebere kansa katika zebenara ebo inti honga 
and decided to bring the boy to Pastor Kanja to be prayed for. You will not be sick again. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Amen. You will not be sick again. Amen. Yes. Pastor, this is Nalugo Irene. Yes. Suffering from back pain for seven years. To the extent that she could not use the toilet, she had to use a bucket. The power of God has touched her. She can now squat. Jesus has performed a miracle for her. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Yes, ma'am. Mama, Praise the Lord. Those are my names. Seven years at back pain. I, I had to buy a bucket to use the toilet. When a man got prayed yesterday, I received my deliverance and my healing. I can't that I've been able to climb here to give my testimony. I'm here in the hall. My God, Jesus. 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 Bless the mighty name. Come by one of you. Holy Nyeri Ayesu. Pastor David, what's happening? Pastor David. Ten years with honey up. Pastor, ever since she was born, he has had honey. It has disappeared. <laughs> Are you okay yeah. now? Mukama call it the Chamagero. God has done a miracle for you. Chamagero chi. What miracle? Aponiza Ania. He has healed me from Hania. How long have you been with it? Since I was born. How old are you? Ten. So ten years you've been having Hania. 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 It has disappeared. Hania again. Who is this one? Hania. 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 So he had honey. I had any honey. Kuba ramazala. Abonye zewa ne chiroa de chwa shoka ngati tutu mani. Nolo vani manga mazokula ne watu gama tio ani yani. Ne watu gama tio tayi na kuta inza ukwona ngati wamulongo. They say they have to operate on him. To mano mutongo yamulongo. This boy is too young to be operated upon. Kati walolo ya sumo watu gama tio awoni. Ne hata ne chidam ne chimolo mabuto. Iranga chivadi chimbonya. Never again. To chiri dana tio. It will not come back to you again. Thank you, Jesus. Everybody, yes. Amen. Pastor, this is Bemanya Grace. She has been paralyzed. She has been paralyzed. She came on a border. It is the border border person who brought her from the parking lot and carried her here into church. Wow. Wow. Young woman, mama. Come here, mama. Over dog or gongo by the Kumara Bangashi. Sanyala do Kumara Bangashi. For a month, she's been paralyzed. What would they want? Where did you come from? Chevando. Mukama kodi de shama kero. What does? Chicho bara sola kola. What could you not do? Yagara unkama ponye upsanya rada. Where are yes? Thank you, Jesus. Never again. To danga na te. Jesus name. Muri nyali a yes. My God. Wait, I'm with the mom. Walk, mama, you can go. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Yes, One year bedridden. Pastor, this man could not use that leg to walk. This is the first time, Pastor. What is remaining is the wound. But he could not use it to walk. God has performed a miracle for him. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. For eight months, Pastor. Jesus. What has happened to you? The mist keep on passing here. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus for your knowledge. Praise the Lord to Jesus. I was brought here on Monday. I've been having this disease in this food for a long time. 
1987 that's when the attack came out. I wasn't able to sit P7 that's another year I did PLE again when came to in September I got a small scar 2014 Every time I will fall sick. Things will come and pull. Pull one leg. And they're saying, let's go. I didn't know where they were taking me. I'm not going anywhere with God. Every time I would get a wife, a wife would leave me. I have six the cast is broken from you. May the cast leave you. Now. You won't dry up. Jesus, my God. Loose him. Loose him. Pastor David. Pastor, this is a Simwe. A Simwe was operated yesterday. He has got a he has a, he had got a tumor. He could not move his hand. After prayer, there is no more pain. He is completely free by the power of God. But in a what was Obujuris of Soka? Mazena sinus kumalemiaka kuminevi. I've had sinus for over twelve years. I would block one nose. So ningena mduwaliro. I went to hospital. They wanted to operate for two million. The doctor said, I want money. But this disease. Ninety five percent. Ninety five percent. Five percent. It will, it will come back. Five percent are the ones who really never so get sick again. He said, "Try something." I said, "What are you meaning? What other method? What other method? So I gave it six months. I got another doctor. He asked, he asked for 1.8 million. I asked him what the doctor said. So I went to the hospital. I didn't believe them. What has God done for you? What was Sunday? The man of God said that TV. Touch where you feel the pain. I held my nostrils until 5 a.m. Kumacha. Every day I would buy a hanky. It's not enough. I, I didn't have any hanky and I was not seized. So so I I said, what has God done for you today? It was operated upon yesterday. I don't even know the plasters went. Right now, when you said do what you cannot do before, they had to carry me around. Now the hand, I can lift the hand normally. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. The devil is a liar. He will not bother you again. Yes, Pastor David. Pastor, this is Francis. Yes. Francis was born deaf and dumb. 100%. Francis yes. The power of God has touched him. He can now hear. I made him close his eyes. And I began to say, Mama, Papa. Mama, Papa. And he began to respond faster. Jesus has performed the miracle yes, for Francis. The miracle for Francis. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. This is a nephew of mine. And my brother died. This boy was in the womb of the mother. 
Boya muzala na agenda na ye Tuamula konga ya kamuzala Kati mama wabali kumkomero yokufa Bambi ita wanuwa mutowa muda kobo na nazena bo Bambi ita wanuwa mba senga Tuwa tusaba shoni omulete alawe kumama we Bwena wagamba nti shoni alikusomero Waita we sawe mune wanga mama wabwa fude Na kuwata sente nengena nechimwa Nentu alori Kwe kusanga yono nga tayogela taulida Era kwe kujana yenga Taina cha ulia le bangali yonatu wadena ye Nga nebu wale kana nebu wa kuwenga leno Taina cha ulida You could not hear anything whether you shouted or you clapped You could not hear anything Mama, 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 Papa, One, Papa, Papa, Mama. Papa, Papa, Mama, Hey, speak. Papa, Papa, Mama, Papa, Papa. Mama. Jesus. Father, thank you. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. His healing has just begun. It's going to get better and better. In Jesus' name. Amen. Let me have one more pastor. Pastor. pastor this man was bedridden. For a whole year. Almost two years. This is Leonard. He yeah. has been bedridden. You get out. You, 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 you. Tambula, tambula, je. Yangu, yangu, yomu suba wali. His name is Leonard. Leonard, pastor. Leonard. Yangu, yomu. I cannot understand that. This from Captura. He could not see. Yes, he cannot see. He's blind. And he has been bedridden. Yes. And he cannot see. Yes. Leonard. For how long has he been bedridden? For one year and ten months. One year and ten months? Yes. So while we pray, what happened to him? He stood up. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Yes. Now, Leonard, put your hand on your eyes. On your eyes. Father, in the name of Jesus, I thank you for raising Leonard from his bed after one year and ten months. Now open his eyes that he may see well, near and far. Ha! You demon that blinded his eyes. Leave him. Leave him. Leave him. Leave him. Leave him. In Jesus' name. Oh God, thank you. Thank you, Jesus, for healing Leonard. Leonard, whatever you see in your eyes, 
look at it. Look at it. Follow it with your eyes. Follow it. You understand the English? Yes. Okay, Leonard. Leonard. Whatever you see, follow it with your eyes. What does he say? Django Lichi Chagamba. Saying that I'm seeing some reflection. Ndabe we into Vitamla Masoga and Wagam. Okay, do. Follow it. Chigobede, Namasogo. With your hand. Chigobede Ningalos. In Jesus' name. Pick him up. Great. Great. In kind. And good. So my brother, is this your brother? He has not been walking. Yes. Are you surprised to see him walking? Yes, I want to see him walking. My God. Okay, walk, Leonard. Yeah, you have to direct him. His sight is just returning. Somebody clap your hands to yes, Jesus. Stand up on your feet. Everybody. Everybody, grab your bag. Grab your bag. In Jesus' name, stand up on your feet. Well, today we have uh, we have several meetings. Feeding of the children, the youth at two, and the service in the evening. And then Christmas, God will bless you. Anybody hungry for the power of God? Lift your hands up. Say, Master, I receive from you. I receive your power. I receive your spirit. My life will never be the same again. I know there are many testimonies, but because of time, in Jesus' name, the Lord told me every time to pray for people to be filled with the Holy Join your hands together. Raise them up. Ooh. The Lord is gracious and merciful, great in kindness and good. To all. The Lord is righteous in all his ways. So bless the Lord and give him praise. And I will bless the Lord. Morashanda pa kutana makotera badoro setera. Join your hands together. Gatia mikono join abuguliani. Start laughing. Tani kokseka. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 
Receive the Holy Spirit. Receive the Holy Spirit. Receive the Holy Spirit. Start laughing. Start laughing. Start laughing. Why? Why? You need the strength of the Lord. Come over here. We have a, a big weekend. You need the times of refreshing. That joy is going to overtake you. You're going to feel like no tiredness. You're going to serve the Lord. Miracles are happening to you this week. The favor of God is with you. May the Lord make you happy. May the Lord surprise you. May the Lord anoint you. May the Lord renew your strength. May the Lord bless you. Oh, touch, Master. Feel them, Lord. In Jesus' name. Catchers. Here. I need you strong. I need you strong. I need you strong. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord increase you. May the Lord multiply you. May the Lord add to you. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' name. Is, Is he here? Join your hands together. Move, move in, move in. Be, be close, be close. Move on the carpet, all of you. Close, close. Lift your hand. May the Lord renew your strength. The whole of this weekend, you may not see your family. This is your family. You'll be catching people. You'll be ministering to people. You'll be blessing people. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord minister to you too. May the Lord fill you with joy. Times of refreshing. My Father, may He renew your strength. May you strengthen you. May He make you happy. In the name of Jesus, the fire of the Holy Spirit burn inside of you. Touch. People join hands together. So Father, in the name of Jesus, I need the Holy Ghost. Do you? Do you need the Holy Ghost? Do you? Do you need the Holy Ghost? Do you need the Holy Ghost? Oh, he's so heavy. Times of refreshing. Everybody join hands. Breathe in. Breathe out. 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 Now breathe in. Touch. All over this place. Fire of the Holy Ghost. Receive the Holy Spirit. Receive the Holy Ghost. Receive the Holy Ghost. All over this place. Start laughing, start laughing, start laughing. Start praising God. Father, I pray you give these people money. You give these people resources. You give these people cars. You give them anointing. You give them the grace. Come on, keep on laughing. This is the best days of your days.
crushed, you know.